one day before Christmas to play Green Cloth Post. Here with this deck you play Cloth Post, which is a land that gives you a mana for each Locus on the field, and then you place Glimmer Post, and the plan is to have a ton of them to just ramp up for mana to cast Emrakul and stuff. So yeah, let's just jump into a league. Deck is pretty simple. You have Reclimber, which is a great addition from last year Magic, which is a fire, well designed card. So that you get to cycle through Badlands or Insurer for Wasteland. So let's see if we find an opponent. So once upon a time, another great card gives you a lot of stability. So you can search your lands or creatures, expedition map and crop rotation. And you also have the dark depths combo because yeah, it's mostly free. A of Ugin to search your Drasis or Ballista and Glacial Chaz to survive. There are cool combos with Glacial Chaz and Festian Stage you can make and Ramon Up Excavator. And then you have a one of Maze of It, which is a card I am not so of a fan, but sometimes it saves you. And we found an opponent. Worst. So we have a cloth post, not green mana. We have these two lands that are pretty bad. This hand this borderline. Hola, Samu. So this hand is borderline keepable. So I think I'm gonna mulligan still. And yeah, this hand is much better. I'm gonna dump the second titan. Hello Jarvis, where's it going? It should be that you just woke up, right? Like, yeah, so that has happened to everyone. Yeah, it's, you have been, in quarantine the last 10 days, so it's just okay. But yeah, the good thing, a lot of magic has been played <coughs> this year, at least at home. So here, I'm gonna take the Glimmer Post because Just making land drops is fine. Here we could get the Kate, that's bad, but. So it seems like this is gonna get decayed. 
It's fine. Oh no. Oh, we got lucky. One time. This is a card we don't want to draw. Yeah. At least next year, maybe things go to normal if the vaccine works somehow. So here they can Astro. Yeah, that's that's not great, but it's okay. So here we have Reclaimer. So I'm going to play Needle first. On Oko. So they're starting to pressure, which is okay. Caracas, so... Swords, yeah. Swords is okay, too. Three for five. So we will have to run against this Astrolabe. They could ponder, so... So... Three, four, five. Uh, I'm not gonna cast some anything yet because I think this scene it will will won't just run into probably false of negation. It's a quotal. Jot air. What's the name? Jot Air Hayden 26. Thanks for the follow. So, yeah, then playing trophies are a bit sad for us, but. DK, sure. So now they have two cards. So, I need to cast a spell this turn. Yeah, this is the fun I expected the turn before. So, giant. And I play expedition map. So Astrolabe, so they're clocking a bit. Maybe they, they have to take my... No, they don't want to take my map. So we draw an untapped land, we win. So here, I can do the same as earlier. No, I think I'm just... So that's... <sighs> I'm gonna get Glimmer Post. I think it's a safer call here, and I can thin it for three. I think that's fine. I can thin it for Rex Age. Yeah. I chuck them a bit of mana and they can get Titan next turn. Oh, Nathan! Thanks for the donation. Uh, just PM me and I will I will send you the the Discord link. 
Okay, this is a great draw. Maybe I should not expose it. So there is no way they kill me now, I think. They can go Ice Fan Kotal and uh, and this, but they have to swords or chase this. So if, yeah, if they go Ice Fan Kotal, Jace Bones, but So here How much mana do I have? That's 5 and 5 is 10. 10, 13, 14, 15, 16. So that's three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So Olamok. Now they will have to elk this or bones it. But yeah, if they bounce it, we are fine. Okay, good night, Nathan. Yeah, you, you, st you stream pretty late usually at night on your time zone. So they elked me. So So here I can get I probably be able to get cozy like Embracle now cuz I gained a ton of mana so that's 6 that's 7 so now we have 6 7 8 9 10 11 ah we are one mana short That's fine. So six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, two mana short. So yeah. Then coffee like it is. So we draw four cards. Hello, Ingifty. So here we just play Expedition Map. I'm gonna attack Oko. Maybe they trade. We don't really care. If they don't, we just gonna get Caracas next turn. And this is gonna be over. Uh, I did, I won a GP with Legacy Storm and I won another GP with a modern um, Titan Shift, but that was a, a team event and my teammates played Devoted, Druid and Storm. Yeah, good old times with GPs. 
Okay, it's fine. So, I think even if, yeah, maybe next year we can play again. This threat of night, or yeah. No, I'm getting Emrakul this turn, so doesn't really matter. Also, the I think in English it's called Vasin. The Vasin is going pretty fast, so so if it works, maybe in four months or so everything is back to normal. Who knows that? Yeah, that's... I have seen the news. It's pretty crazy. That there is a new vaccine there. So, am I cool? Yeah. Yeah, I also saw that, that but the problem is how good is the vaccine against the, against that? So I think it's pretty decent, but that great? I don't know. So it's probably decent, at least. So, but then you have to test uh, a lot of time, a lot of days. So it's not like, yeah, we tested one time, so they have to do work on it. Probably having the first one, it's easy to reshape it around the the others but let's see the other day my girlfriend told me and i just had too loud for instead of crying because it's like oh now we got to solve this and the it's like in the in the video games or on the movies where you just get to defeat the final boss but that was not the final boss there is another final boss and it's like yeah great this and this um real gamble So, oh, okay. Got there. Um, 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 uh, I think I'm more in favor of making land drops than getting Reclimber. Reclimber always gets killed. Oh, maybe force this. They cannot decay yet. They have to sword. So I don't like to board in all carpets because mana is not the problem usually. Uh, it's into place list, but I changed a bit of the sideboard. Like, I think three cards. But yeah, it's mostly yes. So you can check it in, in deck list. Wait. So you have the list. There are some cards I like in the sideboard. Like, I tested the tabernacle and it has never felt great. Then I wanted a collector oof. And I also wanted uh, cross and grips against back to basics. Because it's ticking up in people are playing more back to basics lately. So here we have two plants we can we will eat a land for sure.
let's see what they do. Uh, seems like it's an Oko or Oral. If it's Oral, it's okay, just. Yeah, it's Oko. Create a food. Whoa, that's aggressive. So I think this card is stellar in the matchup and not killing it is a bit of a mistake, but so we can do different things here. One is play carpet. They have two lands. Maybe they force this. Nope. Okay. Green. Map. We copy cloud post. And we stay back here. It's just a Titan into something turn. I cannot eat the land. Yeah, I'm I'm getting cavern. Because I have Titan, so oh dumping sphere. Yeah. I'm getting the cavern, so I can still Titan this turn. Because of carpet, so Yeah, it's true that I don't get all the mana, but it's still great. They miss it a land drop too. So here I think I'm getting. Uh, I can get dark types, but I'm just getting a pair of forests. I don't really need that uh, attack Oko. They're probably just elking this. Uh, no, you cannot do that. Because uh, it will enter with 10 counters still. But you can Thespian stage it. But uh, They can also Dark Depths next turn. They, they may... So they have three plays this turn. Like, killing this, elking this... Switching this for this. Yeah, so they have or to kill this or to elk it. And then they cannot elk this or so. I think it's fine. And they can also not chain cantrips. Yeah, the, it doesn't see, but I think going for the depths plan while I just can. So they have to answer this two cards. If they don't, I have stage in hand to just End of turn, Reclimber for Debs, and do the stuff. So yeah, they have to elk it. Yeah. So that's Uro. What's this? So here I get Forest because of Back to Basics. Yeah, so... Um, yeah, I'm fine. Taking three. So, Leovald, yeah, Leovald doesn't do, eh, it does something. You have to always use it, because if you use it, it's, it doesn't erase your mana, so, green, so, 
Yeah, I think just getting another Titan is a great play. Now it only triggers once if you use it. So it's it's fine. So here I'm gonna get Dark Depths and uh, Caracas. Caracas? Yeah, Caracas for the Leo Vault. So I'm gonna attack uh, Oko. Oh. And play stage. So we are threatening the the combo from one time and from the other. Yeah, Leobold is pretty good against Carpet of Flowers, but good thing here is they cannot cast uh, Astrolabe into Swords, or they cannot cast. So they will have to do different things, like have a land. Probably a natural fetch land for Swartzing or 2020. So I've been liking this deck. So I've played it a lot in the last years. So I think one of the... I remember a, a big event, like 70 players as of four. Spain is decent that I that they played a uh, cloud post and one like and then played it with punishing fire when the Athrite shaman was there I've been always yeah my favorite cr playable creator in magic is prime time so I've played it a lot so they have Caracas for my dart depth, so that's fine What's this? <laughs> Why are they tapping Caracas? Yeah, they get another elk. I get another elk. So yeah, that's okay. We just chill and play once upon a time. Thespian stage, glimmer post. So I'm gonna get glimmer post. And I'm gonna bounce Leovold and Ankeep because oh one second. Okay, I'm back. So yeah, they draw for Leovold. Also, this this play is not that amazing, but they are gonna draw for Carpet of Flowers anyway. So I'm fine just letting. Oh, that's also okay. Ramon up excavator. So yeah. So I'm just gonna attack Oko. Yeah, that's fine. We gain some life. So here. They're probably just eating a forest. They're quite choked on mana here too. Like they cannot cast a lot of spells. 
create food. Sure. Okay. Here, I'm gonna end of turn, sacrifice a forest, search A yeah, of Ugin, and probably just copy Cloud Post because it doesn't do much not copying it. They cannot decay now. Oh yeah, they can. They can trophy. Oh, they can swords. Yeah, sure. So I'm copying this just for the future. Takoko. Here I could get Ballista, but one, two, three, four, five, six, yeah. So we are fine. We are in a perfect spot. Here, the, the pro my opponent starts to having the problem because they can't raise me and they can't also change spells. So... Five, six, seven. That's seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. So I'm gonna pick up Olamog first. Uh, we don't have mana for Embracool because of Damping Sphere, so we have 7 tapped, 8, so we had 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, so we are still missing 3 mana to Embracool, so... Yeah, but if we get uh, Ulamok there... We can Olamok the Oko and the Damping Sphere and then start doing the... FTA from the ashes. Hmm. Also, I think from the ashes is not that great against this deck because you you blow up four lands and you give four basics, so eh, it's not that good. Back to basics is the best card, I think, but. It has the problem that when it gets destroyed, it ends the game. And Blood Moon is also not that great because you can still cast things if you get to six mana. Uh, we keep this. Dumping Sphere, I think it's not that great. Also, if you're playing like a cantrip heavy deck, it lets you 
not play at the piece. Like, you don't ca can't chain cantrips or cards like that. So, it's just okay. I'm gonna play a forest. Yeah, hello, Thought Master. Yeah. Cloak posts are cloak posts. So, this ponder. Oh, free. Hmm, I'm just gonna get Titan. We don't have any Nikasa do anything, so. So this is probably an Oku. It's a golf. Okay. Yeah. What's the good thing that your opponent plays a golf that you can just mess off with it? Map. Maybe playing map here it's not the best, but Yeah. You want to use your, your mana? Sure. So here we just get a cloud post? Yeah, why not? It seems like they don't have a FOSS, so they would have FOSS that every day. <laughs> what good is this card that I was gonna search with the other card? I've got on on paper the other. Oh, but that's yeah, sure. Okay, you have a stifle. So we know they are playing Stifle. Chain binding, sure. That's an ape land. Hola, Jose. Sí, yo creo que es bastante buen mazo. So, they can have another stifle. What's our plan here? So, okay. If they stifle here, I'm just gonna play Ramon up into Mace of Fifth. Sure. Oh. Yeah, I think this this deck is good against Snow, medium against Delver, so not that bad. And it's bad against combo decks, some combo decks. It's good against Tess, for example, but bad against Doomsday or Show and Tell. So, yeah, but the deck is pretty decent. We untap that. They can oko this. Yeah. Okay. One. That's. Hmm. How much mana do we have? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So.
Oh, they oh they took wasteland out. For oh. that's good for us because they could trade the food for for Rabun up and keep the the and would just wasteland me to death. Yeah, sure. Yeah, we thought uh. Yeah, if they have had a uh, wasteland. <laughs> so sure. And they also got the... To play this. This is game is... Just... Let's see. Expedition map. So... Six, seven... Seven, eight, nine, ten. Olamok, eat this and probably this too. Or it's what is better, Oko or yeah? This takes the most pressure out of us. And they probably have a date, but who cares? Yeah, sure. So they have been able to answer everything I threw at them. Just... So. so why do I have to cast? Ah, the land, the bonds, right? Another Delver, sure. So here I can get a uh, Thespian stage. I can get... I don't know what I'm gonna get, but... So... That's eight, that's ten. Yeah, I'm gonna get Thespian stage. I could get A of Ugin. It's quite there. Rainstorm is pretty bad. I don't know. So here, I just have to... So that's still not lethal. Oh, they are copying this. Sure. So they can they get to make my twenty twenty Yeah sure Arcanist, so okay. Seven, eight. So, what can I do? We have any outs here? Also, I can get glacial chance, but. So they are starting wasting me to death. Hm. Look here, bold. So now I don't think I have any any outs from this.
Yeah. So good. They spoiled a new Eleshnor. First strike, Vigilance. What the creatures you control get plus one plus one for each kind, different kind of counters on you and permanents you control. That's really new, Pyrexia. Your opponent and permanents. Oh, that's a weird card. That's strange design. Oh, uh, yeah, that sounds is good. Uh, the needles are mainly to name uh, wasteland most of the times, but you can name a lot of things. So okay, I'm gonna get this, and so you can name Oku, you can name Gristlebrand, you can name Sneak Attack, you can name um, you can name. Here we are not gonna crack the map because they play stifles, so let them choke on, on mana because time is in our favor. If they don't play anything, we just do nothing. So okay, they play a Delver, that's something, but yeah, I'm, I'm gonna just play this because, oh, okay. So we get a cloak post. Reclaimer, cloak post. Bolt the reclaimer, yeah. We're fine with that also. We we just need to play cards. More Delverinos, no wasteland. So I'm gonna do this on Ankeep, so that if they stifle, they stifle on their turn. So they didn't force this, they didn't daze the... I'm really have... Zero clue what my opponent has in hand. Uh, so absolutely zero. More bolts, hmm, maybe. Okay, that's a force of negation. Just the old hard pass force of negation. Sure. So I'm gonna bog them now. Sometimes against Doomsday with the Needles, you can name... You can name... Uh, Street Wraith or Edge of Atom against... Against Doomsday or Elvis Visionaire, as every Vision I know, Elvis Symbiote or... Sure, you got it. So let's see if this Okay, 
this is working fine. So yeah, they have to bolt this, but we got already quite a lot of value. The Ballista was a great draw. They could waste again. If they want to, that's a, oh, I got it. Five, six, not bad. Not great either. So we could probably be on Hardcast Embracul cool Mana next turn. 12, 13, 14, 15, yes. So this is Hardcast Embracul cool Mana. So they can they could choke the extra turn to stifle it, but whatever. 12, 13, 14, 15. Yeah, they're stifling the... So, but I still have a 15-15, a so... Uku has to come and say hello here. So, Expedition map is so bad against... ...and Stifle. I'm gonna play Surgicals just for the Wastelands. And maybe sometimes something else, but mostly Wasteland. So this and your isn't this fine? So I think I'm gonna put seeing it back. Okay. So here we can do two different things. We can play I'm gonna play needle. Okay, wasteland. Yeah, I think it's Oko deals with this card so good. But yeah. Look at what you get. That's a guy for. They are not a lot of. Yeah, I will say they are not on a lot of Arcanists, but. If like I was. They're playing the two, two apes, two Togoyfs, two Arcanist deck that came out the days. Oh, my opponent has lost connection to... Oh, has lost joint. Well, that was fast. Hmm. So here we gain one life. Oh, counter Arcanist. Your Arcanist does nothing anymore. So, and now we are gonna play Needle on Oko. Oko, Thief of Crowns. Hello, Lin. How's it going?
Arcanism is a so good card. So they play it on turn two, and if you don't have an answer, it's so much better than Dark Confident. Because yeah, Dark Confident gives cards, but this is so amazing on, on giving cards. Yeah, you have to have a cantrip in your infinite cantrip deck, or a bolt, or a one mana thing. That's a goif. Wilt. It took carpet out. Yeah. So. They took the carpet. I'm gonna name Wasteland again because, yeah. Oko needs a few turns, so they will have to Oko this, destroy this, Oko this, Oko this, so. So they seem to be in a hurry. Yeah, also just casting the brainstorm there, it's free, so. Completely free. But yeah, why would you not play Rakdelver if you don't dislike the deck? Yeah, more pressure. Should they play Ramon up here? Hmm. I think no. Three, six, seven. They can daze Ramon up there and So here drawing a uh, cavern will be amazing. Unfortunately, unfortunately, all my test animals have died or escaped, so it shall be the final subject. I feel no fear. This is a momentous night. Final entry, yeah. Doesn't seem that. So, huh. three, six, seven. So a bolt kills us anyway. So. I'm gonna copy this and try to tighten next turn. Yeah. Okay, game over. Yeah. The Arcanist is just so good. Sadly, I think they have to ban uh, a lot of cards to make Legacy great again. Or do absolutely nothing. So, if they ban one card, nothing changes. They have to ban Oko, Wasteland. No, Wasteland not. Uh, oof. Yeah. Mm -hmm. This hand is. Isn't this okay? So another Delver or Omnitel. <laughs> Yeah, but do you think that the Delver deck becomes less good if you ban Oko? So you think that the deck is like, oh, it's bad now. So I think the problem is that Arkan is... That Arcanis is also the other problem. Also, there are a lot of problems in Legacy. Veil, Oko, Days, Arcanist. 
So I think Arcan is a real problem in, in Legacy to unveil Veil of Summer. They, they will have to ban too many cards. <laughs> but that's my goal. I can raise that. I can raise that amount of golf. Yeah, this change a bit. So here I'm gonna thin it for one because it's better on the so the next time I can reclimber and thespian copy. Yeah, <laughs> but we have seen that on the design or cards, they have not, whoa, they have not do the right thinking very, very right. Like, meh. I really think they, they really wanted to push the design. I didn't care about this, but this card is just so good. Yeah, Modern Horizons 2 is also a problem. So I think this game is already over. I could... I could get Glacial Chasm and with a Glacial hold the fort. Yeah, Modern Essence 2. When does it come out? This summer? If this is this summer, it's gonna be. I don't know. Modern Horizons 2 gonna be fine. I don't know. Modern right? So. You are meaning that Modern Horizon was fine, fine like this. Like I think this is Modern Horizon. Also, mm, Modern Horizon had uh, Renan Six, Hogak, Altar. Um, it got quite a lot of cards banned from different directions. So I don't think that Modern Horizons is fine like that. <laughs> sure. So, I think Modern Horizons was a complete disaster. So here I need to hit Glacial Chasm. So... So I can make this, so it's three, four, seven. So, game over. Fine. The Denver decks are not a great matchup. 
like just okay. -ish. Yeah, when do you get Red Horde Arcanist? Too many Jasons, a lot. But yeah. I think you have to win the matchup lottery a lot to win. Snowco is good, Tess is decent. And so any deck that tries to go big somehow, you always go bigger. And so yeah, Snowco is like the best matchup. Um, any deck that runs Wasteland usually is not a great matchup. So this deck is just Okay, so we have this, 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 so this one is good. So here we force them to turn one as. The new Kaya, the five mana Kaya is the one you mean. I don't know, five mana is always for me a lot, but I can say because um so here i'm just gonna cycle a land for another land just no need to do anything else Yeah, but starting with five mana is a lot. I, I don't know about standard, so I can say that this is a great card or not. But sometimes slow cards are very good in in standard. Bolt this. Yeah. Always, always bolt this. Why would you not bolt this? So we could get to a real fast wasteland sure okay fine We are in a decent spot. They don't waste. If they waste. Huh. Yeah. Okay. So, double wasteland. Yeah, the, the problem here is that I want that they play more, car more lands into carpet. Because if I don't play carpet, they just start uh, slow, or slow rolling lands. So that's the reason I'm not doing here. So I want that they just keep playing lands. So they, this deck or opponent's deck works on two lands pretty easy, so they can just not 
play lands into carpet. So this is a good reclaimer. That's a 3-4 and... Oh, they Oko it or... <laughs> yeah. I mean, they would have not played another... Another land there. Maybe, yeah, probably yes, but... So I'm at 11. I'm gonna attack Oko. Yes, with counters. So now I'm gonna play this. They already played the three lands. So let's go. Okay, sure. Yeah, you don't have that combo there. Four, five, six, seven. Also, if if we draw a glimmer post, we get to Ola Mok Mana. Yeah, with Champ, so they can have a bolt. I don't think they have, but they could. They elk. Yeah, they elk this because it was a four. Yeah. This another mandrel, sure. And now we are bold proof. Yeah. We don't pay. Uh, like that they, they they trade zero for ten is so disgusting. I paid ten mana for my for my card. And they just bam. So here, copy cloud post. So yeah, I paid six, but still they paid zero. That's still on the on the on the way of not being a great draw. So Faulted farm, thanks for the follow. Let's see what happens with this. They could have a counter. They probably have a counter. Maybe they have a lot of daisies. Yeah, force of negation. Yeah. Mm. I'm 
yeah. They traded just or 10 mana for zero. So this ends up being always a hard counter. I really hate this so much. I have a real hate for this. I think it's a card that makes the biggest damage to Legacy right now. If you will ban days, everything would be better. And happier. It's so efficient. And yeah, that's an unpopular opinion. So Verdant Catacombs into Underground Sea. Yeah, but... Yes. That's not a problem, but... Is it the biggest problem? Maybe yes. But you can't ban Fetchlands out of nowhere. So we are dead. So seems like being back dumps Doomsday Tiger. Oh, this is Tess, sure. Okay, we have sideboard cards for this. Rid of Flame. Burning Wish. No, we are not dead. Something is something. So fetch it's like like with with Astrolabe. Fetchland and Astrolabe makes legacy cheaper. It would probably be better if you if you just reprint the dual lands, but Yeah, I think the Nature was a bit Yolo, but I don't know. People like to do things. Oh, I have something to do. Then I do it because, yeah, I have something to do. Um, what are we going to pick up here? Da, 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 da. I'm just going to get a cloak post. This is a decent draw.
So it seems like they are brainstorm locked. We now have a 2020. And a reclaimer activation. That's probably not gonna do much, but still it is. So I could gain a few life. So, yeah. This is not that bad of a matchup. Also, or deck does things like having Fossil Vigor, Collector Oof, and Mindbreak Trap. And then cards we don't want or need. Mirror of Fifth. Oh, but Yukabog is not that bad. Edition map. So, Ulamok. Yeah, we can have double Titan. Yeah, we can also have just random surgical. Maybe it's better than. No, Rexac is not that bad because they could have a defense grid and. Um, to just killing a wish cloud talisman. So Rex H is fine. Fine-ish. Not amazing, but also a green card. I don't like map because it's really slow. No. No mana, no fun. So we have a turn three. We need something else. So okay, here we have something. So here we have a force of vigor and cards. So we keep this. We put on this and probably the once upon a time. That's a lot of mana. Should I take something? No, I think no. That's fine. Yeah, wish cloud. Okay, here is why the needle is so great. Oh la la. So this deck relies, if they play a turn one Wish Cloud Talisman, they're in so much better spot than if they don't. So Burning Wish for Echo? Or Peer. Okay, that means that... I can do it also next turn. Let's see what they draw and... Just gonna do it on unkeep on this and this. They will need more mana. I could just take the petals. How crazy is that? I'm gonna. Yeah. 
Maybe that's crazy, but... So they have burning wave, echo... Okay. So... They have two decays and two chains. So they have no mana. So they can ha they have the chrome mox, but whatever. Once upon a time, land will be great. Yeah, I think Thespian Stitch is the better land here, because it allows us to. Yeah, Petal is also a great card after uh, any kind of things, and Surika is not that great. Here we get Collector Oof, and this should close quite a lot of doors for them. They will need to draw into a land and then Burning Wish for Grapeshot and yeah, they can now Burning Wish for Grapeshot. They didn't do? Okay. So, okay. Four, five. I don't have any other hate bear. But I do have a Reclaimer in my deck, so... Reclaimer sets up for a uh, next turn 2020. So that's something. I have to... If I copy just the Cloud Post... So... Yeah, this is a decent matchup. So they will need to Burning Wish now for probably Grape Shot. Yeah, but that still needs two turns to work. We could be Cloud Post so we have more mana. Glacial Chasm. I don't really care about Glacial Chasm. So here we get a 2020. Yeah. Chrome Ox. Moxfet has to die for the sins of Pierre, sure. Another Mox, okay. With Echo? Tenders, okay. Three. Okay, so they could have a chain, but not a real problem here. Uh, dark depths. They conceded, yeah. Oh, another needle that does nothing. Okay, yeah. yeah. This is a decent matchup.
Yeah, the new interaction of of Tess is not good against all configuration because this card is really is really good and also making that cards like Collector Wolf and Force of Vigor are good against them. And this with that the needle is good against Wish Cloud Talisman. I think it's just something that goes not well while if you would play ants it's different but yeah Freedom Sly But I've been beating Tess quite a lot with this deck and I also I have seen the into play is the name of oh, another Tess or and they have also been beating Tests, so there's another test or echo. We don't know. Oh, painters. So cast. Here we just named grindstone, right? We don't care much, really. But... You could name other cards. Because we have Emrakul's in the deck and Eldrassi, so Grindstone does not get us. We should have named Karn, probably. Yeah. Yeah, Karn was also a safe name. Echo, yeah, sure. <laughs> uh, grindstone, sure. So I'm going to play stage here and reclaimer. Just trying to get to a uh, 2020. Another LED. They probably also have cards like Whole Breacher in the deck. So they're probably gonna echo again this turn. One, two, three. Yeah. Yeah, they're building up to something, but we don't care much about that. A car, not so sure. This painter echo. So cast, yeah, you can draw. That's fine. Moxta for collector oof seems insane against this opponent. So they probably don't have Chalice, so they should not have Chalice, but I'm very fan of them having Thoughtcast. I really like Thoughtcast. More Ponders, so. That is my opponent wanting. So I'm just putting up the Dark Depths combo. I cannot pressure the Narset. I could should probably just pressure it to if they find an echo don't let them the uh, painter sure they have blast everything is red sure Oh, they have blue blast, probably five, six, echo, sure. Other reason I did put uh, the LED into play, the dark depths into play. It's 
blue and red. So cast. The biggest thing is how they are gonna kill me. Blue blast, so cast sure. LED. Even if, I don't think I am in a bad spot here. That's... Oh, well, they have another echo. Oh, but now I draw seven cards. That's great. Yeah, attacking the Narset did something. <laughs> I win, okay. I don't know what I did or what I did not, but... Okay, expedition map goes... Glacial Tasp goes, Maze goes, but you guys still okay -ish. Olamok is needed. Needle is good, Ballista is okay. -ish. I'm gonna cut a Titan. They have Ugin, Caracas, Bujuka Bog. Mm. I want to cut two more cards. Ramon up is not like the beast of a card, but I think it's fine. Yeah. I cut once a time upon a time. The good thing is they're probably thinking we are on on depths. Or our lands. We have this. So this card does not match. Does not match. So I'm gonna play a forest. On turn two, I'm gonna play clo uh, Cavern on Oof. It's gonna be an asset. Fine, an asset, sure. You can get LED here. Yeah. Okay, so I fear a force of will here. That is like the card that called take our lives, so we just pay the random oof and see what they can do. Here I think I'm probably gonna play stage to have the Dark Depths draw open. I know, okay, this changed a bit. So, I still, I still think that this is the best play. So, ponder, sure. They will need some... More LEDs, sure. So... Hmm. 
Repeat on LED. Sure. Hmm. Why not waiting one mana to get... Storm count three. Painter, sure. So what happens if I copy this? So now I can Titan. And with Titan, I can, I will get Dark Depths and Cloud Post. It's cool that these are Gruel. So everyone that's okay so now the fun starts okay i'm gonna play stage first and attack with titan Get Cloud Post and A of Ugin. Oh, I have to pay ten because so this and this. This stops the the Embra cools from what is this? Repeal the painter, sure. Now without the ley line, they cannot. Um, they will need another ley line to be able to defeat the Embra cool and cosy like shuffle thing. So, Orsa, sure. So they will have to spin and hit Karn, maybe. Okay. Itachi-san, 44, thanks for the follow. So everything is red. Not bad. One mana. Ancient Tomb, they already played the land. Six. Flip. Oh, an echo. Sure. Okay, now we have cross and grip up to and so they will need a lot of mana and search a little for a colorless. Oh, we cannot search with a, a Fugin and this. Sure. I really love this. How cool is this crop rotation? Okay. Two mana. Another grindstone, okay. That is free. So here we can make a 2020 or we can I don't know. Repeal on Mox, sure. Yeah, yeah, they, they, they need a lot, but they can do echo things like draw cards and play zero cover. 
mana cost artifacts. So uh, gain the marks. So we can put here uh, enter in twenty twenty or which I think it's the fine play. They could jump. Put a bridge. They are milling me. Okay, I'm. They could have something like, um, like black traps. So I'm not gonna risk it and just grip this. Okay, they concede it. Yeah. So uh, a decent three two. So I'm gonna be back in three minutes, okay? So don't go away.
Okay, I am back. So, I had to get myself something to eat. So, let's just jump into a leak. So I don't think I have played against this person before, so this is a fine hand. Also, we have a cloth post and, and once upon a time and a needle, so we have a plan. They move to six. Okay, this is an easy hit. So I don't know what they are playing, so I'll wait one turn. <laughs> oh, goblin, sure. So... This is not a great matchup. But it's gonna be an interesting one. This deck is pretty good at surviving. So, yeah, Muxus. Whoa. Shutter school smashing. That was a uh, was not a grade. <laughs> Moxus. So maybe next turn you have to start. Glacial Chasming, I'm not sure. I did play against goblins yesterday and beat them, but... They both times had... Uh a vial hand and I got them with the needle. So there is six, seven, eight. We go to eleven. This probably be another Muxus. <laughs> so not having this in the deck is a bit bad. Hmm. 
So I'm not gonna crop here because if I draw the other piece of the Dark Depths combo, I could put a 2020 there and block. And that will be great. Glimmer post. Okay. So we have Wasteland shut down. And we haven't seen black from them. Oh, they're playing. Oh, they're playing the Chromox Ancient Tomb. One with no blood mons there. Yeah, sure. Okay, this is this is a few turns of of waiting. So goblin chalice for one. Do we want to? Yeah, I think yes. I'm gonna get another cloth post. So that, that I'm able to cast coffee like this turn. That's another turn off. So hey, we can cast the the reclimber with the So another matron. This is probably getting crater maker. I don't know. So we could attack and jump on incinerator. Really? So uh, next turn we have to pay eight. It is a lot. Yeah, then having jump on there. Two, four. Um, just gonna copy the glimmer post this turn. I don't know. So this is probably, if this is a Blood Moon, it's game over. I haven't seen on the Moxos a Blood Moon, but... Okay, another random Goblin. Gobelina. Eight. Yeah, I'm gonna block. Okay. 
Oh. oh. Well. This seems like a great card. So... I'm gonna kill that goblin there. And pass. So next turn, we can do copy the stage. To... I can let this die. Put a ton of counters. Hmm, okay. Now I have to kill things. This. So, killing this too. Killing this too. And just killing another random goblin. They're probably gonna cycle the... Yeah, so I kill all those. Then they can they can play the the reclimber the not the reclimber the they can cycle the drum pound. Maybe just kill another goblin and huh. Yeah, I'm gonna just kill more goblins. <laughs> We could just have done nothing and wait. Goblin ring leader, sure. So it was all a mess. Yeah, the, the problem about the Metron is that they have Incinerator in hand, so if they if they uh, cycle, they kill my Ballista and I didn't get any value out of it. That was my biggest issue with the... with not killing the... So... The problem is, this has Annihilator 4, so I can maybe get somewhere with it. Uh, okay, so here. It's a bit of a problem. I will need to draw green land. So sure. So I'm gonna play this. Oh, I could also just just bounce my cost elect. That's also an option. But I should probably have think of. Yeah, they're gonna cycle. Uh, 
Another random elf. They cycle, kill this. Sure. Yeah, short up just. I'm missing one life to this if. I oh, know I cannot. Hmm. It's bad. I think I'm dead on board. I can't get green. Yeah, I cannot pay. No. I cannot get green mana and... Yeah, but I can... I drew the green mana. I could just Emrakul them. That's a plan. Or Ulamog or something. I have 100 viewers, I don't think. <laughs> Very cool. Yeah, Ulamog is also somehow decent, right? Can Ulamog... One, two... Yeah, I survive with Ulamog. So, trigger on the two haste ones. Yeah, I have to block. Yeah, maybe playing the the cavern on Yeah, still in this game. I think no. I think we are one life short. Because the Legion War Boss makes a token and then gives Mentor, so it's a 2-2. Two -two. Okay. So that's lethal. Anyway. Uh, yeah, yeah, that was my out at the... <laughs> prime time. Yeah, I, I, I might have... We have needed to force their hand on on the on the ballista and then Yeah. Maybe had to force their hand on the ballista. Of the just Try to get the the ballista out of. Yeah, maybe that was uh, an option. They don't play wastelands. They're on the turbo turbo thingy. So I'm gonna put in the the collector oof just because it blocks. <laughs> Yeah, if I if I would have played the 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 cavern on on snake, I could have then next turn play the snake, play the the glacial chasm again after attacking, and then rinse and repeat. Yeah, probably that was the right play. Yeah, having the the cavern instead of forest was. So this hand, da, 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 da. okay, this hand is great. This card is here to pitch. Yeah, I need to draw a land, but
Yeah, we are gonna let them imprint boxes. Okay. City. Blood Moon. Yeah. Now, if you guys don't know, something cool is gonna happen next turn. So, if we gain, go. I'm just gonna chill. Say, oh fuck, Blood Moon turn one. So sad. And something that's gonna happen. Let's see what they do. Play a random goblin. Sure. Due to a ruling change that was made a few years back, now the little, little, little 2020 Married Lage baby comes into play without counters. That means that if you get to... to remove the Blood Moon, they... you get a free 2020. Just things that happen. So what decks I like in Legacy? Also, I like Primetime decks, I like Dark Depths decks, I like Dark Ritual decks. Those are the, the decks that I like the most. So Force of Vigor is a strong card. Hmm, we don't know that. So, the super slow Dark Depths deck, making a turn to combo. <laughs> yeah, Force of Vigor is really busted. This hand goes nowhere. Okay, we have again the same plan as earlier. So we keep this uh, p -p 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 map. I'm gonna put map back. Maybe it's right, maybe it's wrong. Ancient to Chalice, boom. Chalice for one. Should we blow it? I'm not gonna do it. Oh. That's a matron, sure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I, I want to wait, but now that I drew the second force of vigor, I'm just gonna run it out. Because, yeah. I could copy this, like Vesuba, Tom, but that's still only a turn 5 Titan, and I think that's slow. The second one can get hard casted. Help? What do you need? Alex. So... Maybe they, they run out the second... <laughs> <laughs> okay, sure. Oh, okay. And also thanks for the follow. Alex. Reclaimer is in fact just uh, a 1-2 that if you have three lands in your graveyard or more, it's a 3-4, which is quite decent for one mana. Sure. And you sacrifice a land and you search your library for a land and put it on the battlefield. So... We wasted our, our, uh, yeah, but yeah, so you'd never know what you're going to draw. So, okay. Oh, okay. Yeah, some cards. 
this. So, hmm. I cannot get to four mana, right? Oh, I can. I can copy ancient tomb. I ah, know I cannot. Set. So I'm gonna. Let's see. This is gonna be an interesting turn. Oof. That seems like a Muxus. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, the... I could do that if I... Okay, so no hasty things. So Yeah, I, I need to activate Reclaimer for next turn. So they put this. Gempal, Matron, Matron, okay. So they don't have Blood Bond, so... Uh, this does not work, but... That's the land we are gonna eat with. Two. No. If this was a Tespian, we could get there. Hmm. Yeah, no, the Reclaimer is gonna die. <sighs> Let me think. This year. We have a few turns on, on the back of Glacial Chasm here. If they don't draw Blood Moon. Oh, Ancient Tomb doesn't do damage anymore. Great. <laughs> if they have Goblin Settler. No, oh, Goblin Settler will... Is it the name of Goblin Settler? Yeah, this does nothing. Here we could get, yeah, the destroyer land, but. So they have another Gempalm in hand, so. Uh, elf. I'm just gonna pass with this. No, I don't have Rejuvenator. I'm gonna get Ramon up here for next turn, just get to make more land drops. Yeah, sure. 
So to make sure that I get my land drop for next turn. What's this? What does this attacks? Weird attacks like they do nothing. Land. Glimmer post, yeah. So no damage. Look at that. No damage from this. So Ramonap. Play forest. Pass. So next turn I get Titan, and with Titan I'm gonna copy uh, the cycle and destroy my Ramon up. But yeah, we got we got the land out of it. That was the only thing that did matter. So this is six life. So we got to three. So I think we lost this. Also, it could get shuffled in with with. This deck will need a bones land, like green, green blue bones land. Just bones this on this back. Chalice for one, sure. Ah, okay, all goblins have to attack because of because of Rubble Master, sure. That's the reason. Oh, maybe. That means I... That's three... So next turn I have to pay eight for this. So yeah, sadly we don't have the dark depths anymore. So I think it's glimmer post on stage. We we'll get to draw Ballista. We could just attack for for the kill with Ballista. We draw another Titan. It's also not bad. So we're dead to Blood Moon, but we have what we have. So. Yeah. 1414. 14. <laughs> so I guess I block the the two two. They still have a matron in hand, but probably they ha don't have anything to search for. Another Muxus? <laughs> Shutter Skull Smashing. <laughs> uh, there's X damage. Sure. Yeah. 
<laughs> Maybe you should have not blocked. I don't know. I guess we have to block anyway. <laughs> That's fine. That's eight, so we don't get to pay. That's a crop rot, so let's see if they have another removal spell for this. <laughs> they maybe have. Maybe not. Also, maybe they are. Py Pyrokinesis, sure. <laughs> That's okay, too. What did they style? The Matron? No, a Robin Master. So they still have the Matron in there. This is, this is an interesting game. Yeah, and I don't have any cloak post here, so you drank another fossil of vigor would also not be bad. Or cross and grip. Yeah, I'm gonna pay to life. <laughs> okay, so. Or oh oh, we not having the dark depths there is so super bad. Can I do what I think? That I just copy glacial chasm at the end of turn, and then this lets to be so I only have to pay two life each turn. I think that's something that it can be done. So, so I would have preferred to draw a Titan, but Cross and Grip was one of the cards that that were there. Sent out. So yeah, not having the dark is so sad. So I think I think it works what I want to do. I copy this at the end of turn. Oh no, it doesn't work how I want because I am missing one mana. The spin stage. Yeah, I'm missing one mana on the on that. So that's that. So, what is my out here? I can Thespian copy that. I think it's just getting more Glimmer posts, right? I need to... So, yeah, I can copy another thing, but so, so you can copy this and copy this. The problem is this dies. So Chad, can someone help me? Also, if I copy with glacial chances, I copy another land, another thing with the glacial chance triggered on the stack. It still dies, right? Even if I change the name and so. So I'm pretty sure it is, but I'm not 100% sure. 
yeah, so I don't have the chalice here anymore. So You gain three life from this. But I'm gonna play the better this. So now we can pay for one more turn and try to rip a Titan. The map is another turn of living. Scapostit <laughs> of the Gavalista. Yeah, that's that's a plan also. But I can search for it's true I can search for cloth post and top deck ballista or embracool maybe. If I have two, that's ten. So So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So top like this. Top deck, can I, I can play to top deck ballista or embracool. That's one out we have there. <laughs> yeah, seems fine. Seems fine. Top deck ballista or embracool. It's bad on both cases, also. Yeah. Win or lose, this has been a really interesting game. So I have to copy Cloud Pulse at the end of turn. Spyglass. Mm -hmm. So. Oogie in the Spirit Dragon, sure. <laughs> that will be a disaster, but I'm pretty sure they have cards that... Eight, nine, ten, eleven. How many goblins do they have? If they have... If they have 15 goblins, they called... They could um, kill me with eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. And they cannot kill Enrakul yet. I'm gonna copy this land here. Boom! Expedition map. <laughs> this is a cloud post with two time counters on it. Yeah, having eaten the, the dark depths earlier there has been a real disaster. For six, yeah, we have Palista for six, but it has to be for nine. Three, 
Yeah, we are. We could have won. We just missed to have another cloud post there somewhere, but yeah, that was a fine game. <laughs> yeah, I'm pretty sure we have to eat the the Tartars at that point. So this card does the heavy lifting on the on the not having lands part. I have to eat as well. I, I like to stream, but but eating is also. Okay, this seems like else probably. Else is a pretty bad matchup. That's it. So you have to do a lot of things and very well. I could attack for one. But this could be Maverick. If it's Maverick, eh, what's. Oh! What is this? What did place Toxis and seen it? Ramon up. What's this? Who's her? I take this if you're I don't understand. So what the heck is this? So I'm gonna get a Titan next turn. That's the only thing I'm sure of. Some kind of Maverick, weird Maverick. Nick fit, sure, eat your your things. So here we get a cloth post and then this searches for a green land. I'm gonna search for cavern of souls because you never know if we are if they are just super slow rolling uh Super slow rolling out force of will and the blue, so So here we get cloud post and just double cloud post, right? Yeah, just with double cloud post we can just crop rot for the oog in there. So we have to die this turn. Okay, congrats, you have a 3-3. Three, three. Yeah, Nick Fit. Nick Fit is... I never like it, the card, Veteran Explorer. Like, every time, it's like the Time Twister in Vintage. You do your stuff, but you used your mana to do... to get your engine, then your opponents usually get the full amount of mana on the next turn, and bad things happen. Bad things happen if... Like... Yeah, you let them, you take their whatever and they just make Uro, 
Flashback Uro. Mm, what? I don't know. So this is just double double glimmer post and Embra cool. <laughs> How many lands do you want to give me? Yeah, sure. This is a right order. I'm fine. Yeah, they eat something. Here I'm gonna crop. But they could get blue mana or something. Yeah. How many millions of mana do I have? I could have to make the, the... Make that they don't get the... The boost from the... Like, just make the damage on the Dryad and, and the other, but... But I wanted to have the lands. And here I can get Caracas. But yeah. Mm, do we want to cite something in? <clears throat> what could they have? I'm gonna cite in two cross and grips instead of two needles. But that's I could I could cite in the I think the needles are pretty bad, but I'm gonna cite in the surgicals. They probably will never do anything, but yeah, you can remove a a cabal therapy maybe. But I don't really know. Yeah, needle is so bad, so having another bad card instead that could do something. Yeah, you never know if they play something like Damping Sphere or whatever. So having a Cross and Grip and still the Rex H in the deck is fine. Yeah, also, the, the problem about this kind of deck or opponent's deck is that they try to go over the top of other decks, but the deck we are playing is the ending top deck. Also, no deck can get over, over this. Like, it's... No, it doesn't happen. You don't get to be... Uh, glimmer post here. You don't get to be over the top of of cloud post because cloud post is always bigger. What's bigger than Emrakul? Fifteen squirrels. Fifteen squirrels is not enough. Therapy. Yeah, sure. Crop rotation. Nope. Chuck Testa. Okay, you're gonna probably take Ballista, but whatever. Yeah, the plan is to run this to the victory, but they will need some time for it. Yeah, I'm sure. I'm sure. Take that. 
So here this turn I eat the green mana for for a cloth post. This could get Ramon up or a Titan later. Both cards fine. Oops, yeah. This makes some plants a bit less good, but Doesn't seem like they have deed in the deck because that's really slow. I could eat this. I could have eat this to get another cloth post and get a titan with us in it. That's fine. Yeah, I could block and they can eat the lands and anything. I don't care. I even think I could play this next turn. Oh. They will need to eat one day or another. Does this? They crack this. They trophying that. Sure. So now we will be able to block even if. So we can jump both. Yeah, they eat something. Fine. No, they eat ballista. Also fine. Even if they try to eat anything, we can just block, block. What they do? Village rights. Sure. They play Veteran Explorer. I'm gonna Surgical the Cabal Therapies. Uh, yeah. I'm gonna Surgical now. Collector of Questing Beast, Greenson Senate, so they have So they have trophies, Maron Okay, a bunch of nonsense. They tried to play Questing Beast and Titania and win with that in Legacy. Four Hex Drinker, four Uthus. Well, that's a weird deck. That's the only thing I'm gonna say. Yeah. Okay, now you have a four four Hex Drinker, but that's all. I could block that. I think I'm gonna do it. Like double blocking there. This could get out of reach and... Mm -hmm. 
Yeah, someone liked that card. I think that card is pretty bad, but you never know. Prime time. Brum. Uh, the Suba and Ayafugin. Yeah, I'm gonna attack with Reclaimer. I should have played my forest and probably not attacked, but... Yeah, they need to draw something to... Oh, a Wasteland. I didn't sell the Wasteland. Yeah, sure. Glimmer Post and the Suba copy Glimmer Post. Yeah, you have a dead touchy. But they have a ton of mana. I don't think this goes anywhere. Okay, they have they have one wasteland that you can see. The one of wasteland. Because sometimes you need to have one wasteland in your deck. With zero ways of searching it and absolutely no cantrips. So, yeah, yeah. Two damage. That's just enough that Embercool comes. No! Oh, ah! ah. I clicked through it, but I clicked through my main face, but I have found 24 lives. I'm going to search Embra Cool. 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21. Yeah, sure. I take three damage. Swap. The power is strong in our opponent. Not to be bad or so, but this is too much nonsense. Oh, I activated my elf again. Yeah. Who would have expected? So good. I'm liking this sideboard and the approach yeah the uh, i'm in favor that everyone plays what they want and what they think but their deck was not that cool like okay if, if you're doing not powerful enough things, but they are cool enough. I think that's good. But at the end, you're playing a medium shell with not the most fun deck in the world. So I've played against a guy that has been playing uh, like equipment with kobolds and, and Isamaru and this, and that deck was cool. You had quite a lot of things. And the deck wasn't really good, but... But you you did your you did cool stuff when you did. But here is yeah, I sacrifice better and I spread get Titania or Questing Beast. I don't think this is gonna hold in the format. But yeah, some people like that and say yeah, okay, I like to to do that. What is this Lance Loam? Probably Lance. No one play Loams nowadays. Maybe yes. 
Yeah, that seems like the green white lands. Oh no, that's really low arm. Also, low arm is a bad matchup. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, yeah, the, the equipment deck was sweet. Also, completely nothing against the equipment deck. It was strong and also maybe not strong, strong, but it was. I'm gonna keep dark depths because you never know when you can't just on them. So this deck has wastelands, abrupt decays, Okos, Knight of the Relicary. So yeah, I think hmm, they didn't get. Oh, maybe it has three months. Yeah, here, MM17. That was the deck. Like, it wasn't the strongest, but you had really strong cards in, no, in, in Rongrad, no, in Fervent Champion, um, Javier, Javier Dominguez, uh, or Spanish World Champion from 2018. And you had Kithion, which is uh, an Thurgo. So the, the deck did cool things. Stoneforge Mystic, at the end, it was, you have a lot of equipment, like Jutus, Swords, Battle School, and and Sophie and then with with the Fire and Champion you can just play and equip them. The first time I played against them, they had an equipment that if you attack with it and you unequip it, you can cast a spell from your deck for free or something like that. So the deck was not bad at all. So Goblin Engineer got your Winter Orb or Canonist, so the deck was pretty decent. Yeah, Soon Fortress, yeah, right. So here they probably the good thing about getting decay is that they getting this is that they probably think we are a dark depth deck. So they play mates because they probably have Caracas in hand. That's my So Javier is a great player. It's really, uh, he works really hard. And he doesn't care about playing not the coolest decks. Yeah, that was... Yeah, that's the reason. This deck has so... Surgical Extraction is pretty good against this deck in the sideboard because they... They get to... If you strip all their wastelands, their deck is almost nothing against a regular Oko deck. So, but it's, they have to already have to wasteland you one time. So another confident well, big problem power. So here we are gonna play the Suba. Yeah, sure. Yeah, they play Misty. They play all these cards. Sure. Yeah, I'm. I'm still gonna keep the going for the the lock to turn off. So yeah, that was something I didn't want, and then the reason I maybe wanted to play Boku Kabok, but yes, they have to hit this. I think it's probably better to just sure. Okay, the cycle the. Probably draw a card, yeah. So I will get the of these three pieces of the combo. The problem here is we are on a clock that's not shabby. No, Reclaimer will do some work here. Yeah, they may have some removal, but this is gonna stop the bleeding for a bit, but not so. And double confident. This card, uh, like the Sylvan Library, are really good. Okay, another wasteland. Yeah, 
this isn't horrible, but now with the with this with another wasteland, we also have nothing to pay into it. Seven. Mm. Yeah, let's see. Maybe they have like a ton of Leovold, Uro. Poof. I feel sure. Eh, if I would have had one more turn, I could have maybe. If they didn't get to kill my. So. So here, maps are decent. All those cards are almost nonsense. So Rex H is okay. They have chalices. I'm gonna cut the two maps just to have less CMC1 cards in the deck. But the plan is that they get to turn one, that we get to surgical the wasteland. So, yeah, I don't know if in this league or this morning or yesterday I played against a Denver player who didn't cast, he played on something, a Tarmogat or so, and didn't cast any cantrips and for four turns in a row they did um, Wasteland me non-stop, one, two, three, one, two, so... Yeah, maybe this stops the bleeding and we get to Olamok. Yeah, this is one of the less good matchups. What they have? Same it? Yeah. So they can decay and and yeah. So if they, if they don't do it, be it. Okay, this, whoa. Okay, they want to. Well, that's fine. So they need to have a decay there. Probably they have. So we have turn to ignite. Hola. So they're cycling, so they're searching for something for a decay or something to cast on the needle. So this is fine. So they... What is this? Oh cool. Yeah, that... Chalice on one, sure. Wasteland, okay. So we get to to Ulamok here. This and this. Okay, they concede it. Yeah, I think they cannot kill an Ulamok anyway. So. I would like to have more cards. I'm gonna board in. I'm gonna cut two maps and board in two Force of Vigors just for having less CMC1 cards and having more answers to Chalice or fast starts with Moxon. Like if they all go Mox Chalice and I have Fossil Vigor then our hand is great. So here... Yeah, this hand has potential. We have a Needle, so... Mm -hmm. 
Okay, this is the the situation where the well, that's a confident sure. What's another confident? Can be an OCO. Okay. They, they want to draw cards. Not sure, always good. I'm gonna play a Cloth Post here because this allows us to next turn play Ballista for two. I know they get to draw two cards, but I think it's still worth. The Sutical on Ruder is also not the worst. We could even maybe get to... Ruder, sure. Nah, we don't get to... to take them down now. So they get to Sylvan Library too. This is a bit of a disaster, but... One, two, three, four. Yeah, sure. So Yeah, I think this is the, the right play. I'm gonna put a stop on my opponent so that after my opponent uses Sylvan Library, I'm gonna Surgical Uro. Again, this can be really bad for us, but... Maybe they play so that they... They will draw a card with... Okay, they have Loam and nothing else. Maybe they had a good card on top, but... So... They have two Ley Lines. So they bought the two Ley Lines of the Void. That's crazy. Chalice, Cabal Pit, Moxon... They have Ramon Up Excavator. Yeah, okay. The good thing is we have here a turn where they don't do something cool. So they have Loam. They have Bok. Hmm. This is also not bad. Two, three, four, five. So, if we draw a Glimmer Pose, we get a Titan, and that should be game over. If not, we probably don't get a Titan. Decay, Wasteland, sure. Yeah, they drew the Decay. Obviously, it's a disaster. Yeah. But so they have Loam there. So they have Loam in the graveyard. Oh, we fight the Loam. Our only way of fighting this is getting a Reclaimer. 
and pull you kapoking it. That's a triad arbor. So, yeah, this is a real ma bad matchup, but. I think we will have. Oh, we drew the Glacial Chasm. Whoa. We only have one Uro. We could maybe kill them with. with the. with just the. the, the Confidant. Yeah, that's a plan. And this deck has to even Blast Zone now. Yeah, the Blast Zone has also changed a lot. Yeah. Seven. Okay, they didn't dredge. One, two, three. What are they doing? Hardcast Leyland. Sure. So I'm gonna eat this and get Pojuka Bok. Flip Knight, sure. So yeah, I'm gonna wait on the Okay. They can't gain life anymore. And... So we choose Bok, Bok them. So no wasteland for you. Now they get tonight. Here yeah, I want to preserve my life total just because the confidant is my best win condition, I think. So hmm, that's a crop. I could get a twenty twenty here. Wow, one, two, get this, yeah. Silver library, go to two. They okay. Sure. They don't have Caracas anymore. So if they get to tap the the knight, because I exiled Caracas with, and they they do have Mace of Fifth. Yeah, they have knight, Mace. Okay, if they top the knight, we win. So, yeah. Greatness at any cost. Mace is not, it's not removed, right? No. Luan for Thicket, fine. They try to force me into... To 
getting the Luan spot. I'm fine. Wasteland, okay. So here... If they cast Wasteland... I could just eat Glimmer Post. Not removing Maze seems... I don't know. Alex, would you remove Maze against my deck? I think it's like one of the cuts that you do because... Maybe just being able to make the combo with the Knight is good enough, but... That's how Wasteland... Yes, I think it's... Whoa. That's greedy. Yeah, yeah, so Leyline is nonsense. Maybe they don't have cards, but... So they're at one. If they attack, I'm not gonna maze. What is this? Lum on Wasteland and Thick Dead, yeah. I'm gonna move here again. Vesuba. Unbog, bog them. Okay. That's one more land that got get exiled. Cabal pit, sure. Okay. Cabal Pit the Confident. Uh, oh, you guys are gonna see something cool. I oh, I'm gonna win this game. So this is gonna be so cool. So I promise. So no clickbait. Yes. I could have kept Bespian stage, but whatever. Boom! Copy your Dryad Arbor, die! Yeah, Bespian stage there was better, but. The usual die to your own Dryad Arbor. Yeah. That's a great. Gracias, Poita. Uh, yeah, the confident did work, but killing with reclaimers. James. The other day, James said that he, I am undefeated against him, which seems pretty strange because he always plays good decks and plays tight, but it's true that I get lucky. At least the last time we played, I got pretty lucky. So he used to play... Uh, Grixis Delver or Depths. So, okay, so it's Depths. I'm gonna cast once upon a time. And. Uh, da, 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 da. 
I can get the forest. I can copy the forest, so that's not a big problem. I'm gonna get stage. Crop sure. So this is, I think, not a great matchup for him. Okay, this is a great draw. Here we name Hexmage because it's the fastest way of killing. The, the, the way that I fear that I could die next turn. And from there on, I can copy the green source and... So they do this, which is fine. So... I would like to cop. I'm just gonna play a cloth post. Next turn I can Thespian stage the mana confluence and if I want to change later, which I probably gonna want, I'm... So here we could get hit by double... by double crop, but we get our own 2020 and at 21 life. I really love this crop rotations. Yeah, okay. They could get a wasteland this turn. Stage, sure. That's fine. Okay. I have no hits. Seems like they kept a uh, hex mage hand and... Here there is also another thing that if we get to... to draw a needle here... No, uh, Ramunap Excavator. If we get to draw a needle here we can we can shut off the stages so here i think to copy this i'm not gonna copy this turn because we could get 2020 in response so i'm just gonna pass and and this is, and call it a day Because here, I really don't want to get 2020, so I'm gonna chill and pass. So, here, I guess, copy Glimmer Post. Yeah, this allows me to double, to Titan and double. If I crop, yeah, they, they need they need a lot of things, and now with the Titan draw, I can next turn um, smash Titan and just get Caracas and Mace, for example. Yeah, hex mage. Yeah. So they cannot, they, they probably have an Elder Spirit Guide, but uh, yeah, 
they get rid of my Ramon up, but I have a Titan rolling, rocking and rolling. Yeah, they they could maybe move here, but. Green, three, four. Hmm. Oh, stifle. That's elegant for sure. Okay, but they, they cannot put a 2020 now on board this turn. So they need to get to get rid of this. And not having Orborg has hit them a lot. Yeah, so we have a, a leverage of one turn still on the... We can get our own 2020, so... I think Emrakul comes down anyway, so... I will have to count on the... Also... Cloth post. I, I searched to post. This makes five, six, seven, eight. So now. So I'm going to search for maze here. I could have gone for lethal, but I think I'm I'm not going to lose this game anyway. So here search Caracas and Dark Depths. Yeah, the problem here is not searching for Caracas. They could have a knot of this world, so I don't want to lose my Titan to this. We are 23 life, so I don't think we are gonna lose anyway so we remove this from the combat so they, they they now need to have a ton of things because we have our own 2020 we have a titan next turn still so they they need to to do quite a lot of stuff i don't have caracas so they need to have security step for for this and that's just one hit through so i think there is no way they win and now we have all 2020 maze caracas next turn so seems fine I need a shirt. So they name Caracas. So we have a 2020 facing another 2020. So. No, I had lethal. I could have attack with both, they have to block there. But anyway.
They're gonna block, so I'm gonna tap this. So, yeah, still not enough. Maybe I should have to get another plot post. So I'm gonna copy Maze of it next turn. Uh, Caracas is now named with Needle. Uh, we have Enraku still with Club Post this turn, so... So, okay, here, we are gonna board Surgical Extraction against Turbo Depths because it's a great card against Turbo Depths. No, it's a really bad card. Don't do this. Don't side and Surgical against Turbo Depths, please. Doesn't even do it against Slow Depths because if they play something graveyard based, they play one life from the Loam. So, So then the cards are Force of Vigor. Everyone boards Surgical against that, and it's so bad. Like, really, so, so bad. So, the Bujuka is bad. This is. These cards are okay. This card is okay. Surgical is so bad. So uh, I'm gonna side out my own dark depths because yeah, you never want to draw it, and you want to go to the end game where you win because they lose. Mm. On the play, this hand I will keep this hand on the play, but on the draw, it's a no go. Mm, this hand is pretty good. I'm gonna put Olamog on bottom, even if Olamog is great. Here, just getting over random 21 life. So this, this is so really random. <laughs> and we drew the replacement and draw C just for to be sure that we have one in hand at all times. Be sure to have an Eldrazi and then we see. Here decay. Yeah, decay is fine. Random one life. Yeah, yeah, that's sure. The other day I was playing for the 5-0 with this deck and the the game three of the match I was I was like one land away, any land away of winning. Because I had Ulamok and Nine Lands facing uh facing um 
facing a, um, a Blood Moon. And I, should, I only had to cast Ulamok. And my, or any green card that was decent, because my opponent had nothing but this. My draws were Kothilek, Emrakul, and... Yeah, I think that was my draw, so I just need one land to blow up. Yeah. Here, even if... I'm going to play the maze, because the maze makes that we are one life over 21. So I'm keeping the statu quo on that is really relevant. Maith also protects from not of this world. Why? Why does Maith protect of not of this world? I'm missing something. So having double because they could have crop rotation there, but it's just because of that, right? Ah, yeah, 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 sure. If they, they have the crop at last turn. Yeah, sure. I could copy my cloth post. So... This is for Wasteland there. So here I can get a Titan. If they, if they wasteland maze, and so if they don't play wasteland, I will just gonna maze crop and get a titan. Also play the titan. If they don't deploy the wasteland. They should probably maybe they they can deploy other cards. Yeah, that's fine. What is this? One life? Whoa. Whoa, the beats. Okay, sure. So, yeah, I'm gonna just eat the... If I got Fluster Storm tier, I don't think this should happen, but... And we are at 24, so I don't fear. They, they could stifle this. But they will lose one or the other. So this is a cloak post, and this is a... Also, do they have any way to win next turn? They can... I'm just gonna... I'm gonna play a bit safe. i probably get a hit with the Titan here. Yeah, yeah. They, they could have like Elvish Spirit Guide and something else and something else. So I go to 29 so that they cannot do like... I don't think that they have cards. Like they, they put... I uh, know they cannot pr do proper green on both. Yeah, but anyway, we are gonna get Emrakul next turn. Yeah, my my logic was that they. Yeah, the <sighs> fucking spirit. Oh, sorry. This is having wings always deceives. So. Okay. Yeah, late red plus at uh, swinging plus. I've been playing fling in this deck one off. Uh, 
Emra cool eats everyone. So, 3 1, yeah, better. So, muddy. Huh. We have a twenty twenty, but nah. I'm going to ship this. I'm going to remove. No, nah, I think I need lands. One thing I'm missing from this deck is that, that it does not play Dryad Arbor, and I think it's a fire card to have. So, do this test. Oh, yeah, this is the guy who beat me on the 5 0 the other day. Yeah, sure. Chandra, uh, Torch of Defiance. So yeah, no. this being Magus of the Moon means that we can't get... Yeah, but this is Magus. This is... Yeah, that's the problem. This is not Blood Moon. And now we are on our clock. On a pretty decent clock. Yeah, I will need to draw Ballista. But... Meanwhile... I'm gonna get this. Yeah, this guy took a 5-0 already from me. And I was about to win. I, I misplayed game 1, so... So, this is the hell of a clock. So, one, two lands. I cannot get a fetch. That's bad. One, two. Nah, that's just straight dead. Yeah. Beep, 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 beep. So, cross and grips. Cothelec is bad. Burjuka is bad. Excavator is fine. Maps are medium at most. Caracas can be cut. And two maps. Yeah. The close post deck against the moon deck is not the the most fun experience. So you really just get a forest to have our forest ready and we cast those TMC one. Land go. So 
So now should be the tomb time. I could have probably copied the... So that's a blood monster. Why not? Okay, that's a car. Yeah, blood money into car is. One of the bad scenarios. Oh, I did that. Oh, sh I didn't use the map. But anyway, I'm going to search for Rex Age. Get my 2020, so... So they will be forced to to get the bridge, and I can kill the car. Yeah. I can play the lattice, the quoting, sure. Hmm. Here, searching for a second reclamation stage will be pretty good, but... Trying a forest will also be great. Like this one, I'm gonna draw out now. That doesn't do anything. Reclaimer. Reclaimer is fine. Yeah. Titan. Float post and yeah, I'm gonna get A of Ugin because if they if they ramon up if they carn and kill it we can get it again. Chandra, sure. Two mana, car, chalice on one, fine. Chalice on zero. That's so that we can't attack. Sure. So, can I get Ulamok here? Sixteen. I cannot. We lose two mana, but we gain mana on the other way. Olamok. So, okay. So we kill the bridge. Okay. 
so any changes? Collector Wolf is not bad against that. The Collector Wolf is worth. Yeah, we have we have Ballista for Magus, but huh. we will need a. Uh... We have mana and we have Tartus, so if we get to draw uh, one of the five, so here we have a great plan against. Chris, Chris Descent, thanks for the follow. So if they have Magus, so Grand is pretty decent, I think. I think this is a keep, not a great keep, but we have once upon a time, we have the dark depths, we have a cavern for a chalice if they get to, so we can name elf or maybe titan in the future. So I think having a plan is something, and if they mold to five, then having a plan just drawing the random Dark Depths main deck is great. We have green cards for Force of Vigor. A Basic Forest. So, while not being in the best shape, we are in some shape. So, I'm gonna cast this. Uh, just get a random forest. And I'm gonna pass cast this because this could lead that I play other lands that I draw, and then this is a Karn. Yeah, this being a Karn could be bad. Turn to Karn is not something. Chandra, hmm. we can deal with a Chandra. I'm pretty sure. Pithy Needle will be great. Reclimber is fine. Here we get again rewarded for for searching the or getting the fetch there. They have to minus the this you can just ballista and kill the okay chalice for one or for two or for three you never know chalice for one okay we already casted our cmc one spell uh i'm gonna stay <laughs> Fine. Uh, we are going to name Elf here and cast Ramon up. Now we are pressuring the Chandra somehow. Oh, and a card, so three and three is four. Yeah, we can pressure both. That's fine. Karn. Tomb. Bridge. Bridge. Bridge, bridge, bridge. So uh, 
I'm gonna attack car so that we don't get latest. <sighs> Play this. Uh, they could cast one spell the next turn. So I'm gonna play a ballista for one. We need to draw a cross and grip here. Maybe we get just to the Titan. So they have two cards in hand and. So if we draw Force of Vigor. We still have to raise the Chandra somehow, but we can do it. Yeah, they, they played a turn one Chandra. <laughs> that was absolutely not what I wanted. Yeah, the needle was exactly one turn late. If I could have had one more turn of... If I would have drawn the Chandra one turn, the needle one turn earlier, I'm pretty sure I win this game. Yeah, we don't have any cloud posts here, yeah. Oh, ah, they choose mode one, okay. You don't know what modes they choose until it's too late. Okay. So, oh, okay, here. <laughs> Yeah, okay. So here we get Reclamation Sage for the... for the... the Chalice. And then name Karn. And at least we have got rid of the Karn. I could have got the... No, that doesn't do anything. This... Yes. Karn, the great creator. And now we will race with our Titan against the the car the Chandra Ultimate. Which is not something that hard to do. If yeah, they got another, okay, yeah. It's fine. So we we can we can get there. They have four we will have to gain life this turn. Hello NBD Big Buddha. So they can cast this but two life. I would draw another needle, but also not be bad. They cast it. Yeah, that's five damage. Whoa. That's something. Uh... So, how oh, I win? 
probably drawing a card that kills the bridge and attacking. So... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So here I go to 13, and if I draw an, uh, an Ulamok, I can win. If they play a land. So they have two damage on the on the Chandra and and maybe five on the other side. So they exile the chalice. So I have here two outs. One is what a search for for glacial chasm. Gives me three draws on that. A bit and that to a blood moon. No, I think this is fine. Five damage. Okay, I go to eight. They cut it on one, so they probably don't have other two spells to cast. One is a land, and the other is Blood Moon, sure. It's five damage. So... Huh. Eight. Yeah, I would have need Force of Vigor. Ah. So if they miss on the... So... If this would have been a Force of Vigor, I would have won. I think because I can swing for... Can kill both. And the blood moon there got us quite a lot. So, so I go to one. <laughs> I can attack, but my attack does nothing. So yeah. Yeah. Okay, yeah. Yet. Yeah. Everything one turn late. Yeah, we drew the needle one turn late after they play the chalice for the Chandra. Then they drew the blood on the turn that we was going to draw. Yeah, just We're on less life, but... I think I did the things I had to do each turn. And they, they got... I think they, they got pretty lucky on their Molto 5. Their Molto 5 was turn 1 Chandra. Then they got to... to flip the Fire Confluence, which probably they only have to... 
that was like the best card because they called get off my board and my board was uh, pressuring the Chandra that got the ultimate. Pretty fair. Yeah, fine. It is what it is. So, okay. So this is going to be for today. We played 10, 10 matches with this deck. I, I like it a lot. The Blue Moon deck, even if it's hard, is not unwinnable. The, there is one card called Fossil Figure, which is like the Nuts and wins games on its own. But we didn't rule it and we didn't have a second Rex Age, which will not be crazy to have sometimes. But yeah. Okay, thanks for everyone being here and Merry Christmas and see you next time.